springtime, everybody's getting out ready for play, but there are some things they need to be careful about that are not necessarily having to do with being fit, but with the things around them being fit. Spring is upon us, and new sports uh, always crop up in the springtime, and the youth that are involved in the sports have special problems that are unique to the condition of their playing. What should parents and coordinators be looking at? Well, there are three things that I like to talk about. The first one is field condition. As the winter ends and the spring begins, not all fields are in the best condition. The field should be inspected. People should walk around, make sure there's no obstacles, things that would hurt your child that otherwise in good field conditions wouldn't hurt your child. And then there's the equipment. So the second part of it is that your child has grown over the winter, and many times the equipment that they have from last year isn't good for this year. When you look at field condition and equipment, the field conditions and the equipment should match, and this equipment should fit your child. We, we see quite often, especially in the younger ages, like, say, 10, 12, 14, in, in those years, that the kids don't always seem to be, like, the same size. There's a chronological age and a physiological age. Not all 12-year-olds are 12 years old by their bone age. Some of them are 15 years old and some of them are 10 years old. So a 10-year-old bone age child might weigh 98 pounds, whereas a 15-year-old bone age child might weigh 150 or 160 pounds. Playing football at age 12, those two is a big mismatch, and a lot of injuries occur in that manner. So I always worry about that when I see a small kid going out for football, and they're not really big enough yet to play with the other kids on the team. Dr. Alan Resnick, this is Christopher Michael reporting. Yeah, there's a special website that was set up. It's called StopSportsInjury.org. It has actually tips for parents. It has tips for coaches, um, and it has it for sports specifics. So, for example, field hockey might have one special set of concerns. Baseball might have another special set of concerns. So if you're a baseball coach, you can find the concerns for baseball. If you're a field hockey coach, you can find the concerns for field hockey, lacrosse, etc.